Good evening, Grantham. Welcome to the live broadcast of the Place to Be Charity 2022 sorry, charity calendar, uh, which is a little bit cheeky, and you want to stay tuned to have a look at this. But before we do that, I just want to meet, introduce you to some of the guys who have taken part in this, all volunteers or friends of the Place to Be. First guy that I've got over here with me today is Jason. Hi, Jason. How are Hi, you? Yeah. Not too bad, thanks. Good stuff. So just talk to me a little bit about the Place to Be. So the Place to Be is for men supporting them with mental health. This is a place where they can actually come down, where they can feel safe, okay. meet new people, and actually feel welcomed as well. Okay. A lot of places in the areas, you have nowhere to go. So coming down here, you can actually do one-to-one -one with them to see where we can actually help with them and give their confidence as well sure. to move forward. Sure. And you clearly, you've been running now for a few months, haven't you? Not particularly long, is it? Um, just three and a half months now. Three and a half um, months. So we've got volunteers who are mental health first aid, it's first okay. aiders, okay. which um, any company, companies out there would like to actually do first aid course, yeah. mental health first aid. Um, I can actually teach that and okay. actually all the profits would come back to support the charity. So you'd have a qualification in mental aid first, first health yes, um, uh, for each company, whether you're man or woman, or you're staff employed, whatever, uh, you'd be able to give that sort of um, commitment to them and it in return be. they would give you that uh, sort of security that they've got people to look after. A lot of companies, um, sometimes when you know people are off with the sick, yeah. sometimes it's dealing with mental health. Yeah. But having somebody in the workplace, mental health first aid trained, sure. they'd ask somebody to actually go and t turn to. Sure. And actually, this will actually keep them you know, employees in work cool. as well. So, obviously, we'll come on to Tracy if that's all right. So, Tracy, can you tell me a little bit about what we've been doing? So, basically, I had an idea at three o'clock in the morning to raise awareness for men's mental health okay. and to break the stigma of men's mental health and suicide rates in Grantham. So, we came up with the idea of running a calendar. So, we thought we'd do a little bit of tongue in cheek. I managed to rope in 12 lovely guys, if not a few more, for the calendar. Um, so you'll have a good variety of men of all ages and sizes. A couple of dad bods, a couple of nice sexy ones, so yeah. So what are we going to see then, Tracy? Well, you're going to see a lot more than what your imagination would like you to see. Probably okay. a lot more than what some wives would like to see. Okay. But yeah, just for our, um We'll, come, we'll just a little, little bit of a teaser there. We'll come on to that in a second. I'm just going to go and say hello to some of the guys who are in the room with us. Uh, so we have the mascot, as you can see here. He doesn't wear this normally. This is just for uh, for today. I'm going to start off by uh, saying hello to Nigel. Hi, Nigel. How are you? Yeah, fine. Thank you. Good stuff. So you are the chairman of... The, the South Links Blind Society. Oh, you really? Which is the uh, overriding... Um, charity that actually supports the place to be and the beehive community here right, so. which we've been in here for since 5th of march 2020 uh -huh. and obviously a lot of the work that we're doing is with the mental health we yeah. have the nhs involved yes and we have uh, outreach workers and we have a Lincolnshire County Council mm -hmm. um, team from the Shine, which actually support us in running the men's um, place to be as well. Cool. Yeah. And you're a geography teacher from a former I'm, geography I'm teacher. I'm a geography teacher, 38 years at uh, what used to be called St Hughes School. Okay. So all those uh, ex-pupils <laughs> out there might want to see me... Um, just with a globe, actually. <laughs> <laughs> they I'll might find that's very, very funny. One final question then. Uh, what's the capital of Belarus? Belarus. <laughs> 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 um, we then have uh, Scott from S&J Building. Hi, Scott. How are you? Yeah, good, thanks. Good stuff. Yeah, I'm, I'm very well, thank you. So uh, why did you feel the need to get involved? So I'm good friends with Jason. Um, I'm ex-military. I know there's a lot of men's mental health issues around. Mm -hmm. um, and when he mentioned that he was starting up the place to be, mm -hmm. I thought, yeah, perfect place for me to help mm -hmm. out and volunteer. So I came along. I've done the mental health first aid course. Um, and I'm one of the head volunteers down here, okay. here every Monday and Thursday. Yeah. Um, and then one evening, because my wife also volunteers here. One evening, we were in the big room at the end. I went away to get a drink and then I came back into the room and my wife and Tracy said, oh, by the way, you're in a calendar. <laughs> oh, am I? 
Yeah, a naked one. <laughs> <laughs> and that's how I ended up in the calendar. There we go, there we go. Thank you very much. So, then we have Martin. Good evening. Are you alright? Good evening, viewers. Very well, thank you. Are you uh, you're from the Avenue Hotel, aren't you? That's correct. Great stuff. So, uh, again, what was your reasoning for wanting to get involved? Uh, clearly, I think, as everybody's portrayed, this is uh, the, the place to be is, is something that is very essential to a lot of mental health out there. Mm. Um, when Jason and Tracy approached us, they needed some uh, some sponsorship for the calendar. Yeah. So we got together with uh, Price and Son, yeah. and uh, as, as as two companies are, we've uh, we've sponsored the calendar. Mm -hmm. uh, and I also got uh, dragged into <laughs> to become uh, one one po one of the pages in the uh, the calendar. So, I'm, so, uh, I'm pleased your bar's as high as it is. Let's put well, it that way. Yeah, it's, uh, you know, it's, 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 it's not something we provide at the hotel. So no funny ideas there. <laughs> Good stuff. And then finally, I've uh, got David here. Hi, David. How are you? All right, thank you. How are you? Yeah, very well, yeah. thank you. And there's a page in there in the calendar, isn't there, for the veterans? Yes. There yeah, is. and you're the representative well, for today. <laughs> one of them, yes. Yeah, great stuff. There was quite yeah. a group of veterans in there, yeah, wasn't there? Yeah, there's a lot of us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. there's a lot of military people come here. Yeah, good it's stuff. a very good club. Yeah enjoyable yeah. and it's done me a world of good. Great, that's great to hear. Mm -hmm. So probably the part that everybody who's watching is waiting to see is um, maybe a little bit of uh, what Tracy's got in front of her. Now these are limited edition. Um, there is just 500 of these been printed. Uh, I think around 80 of them have been sold so far. I'm just going to poke this over Tracy's shoulder. This is uh, Mr November. Now Mr November I think is in the room. Mr November is David, the veterans who we've just spoken to. So as we see this here, you can see there's very, very little um, to the imagination, which is brilliant. We've got April Fool. <coughs> I'm not sure who this clown is, but um, this, is, uh, this is April. I'll tell you what, it's a great photograph. It's got a dad bod. <laughs> no, if you I'm like joking. a dad bod, you can get one. Here's um, Mr August. This is Martin from the Avenue Hotel. Nice shiny bar. Thankfully, like I said, it's quite high up. Jason Stratham lookalike. Jason Statham here, Grantham's own answer to Mr May. Now these are available, if you want one of these, you can buy one of these for £7. Uh, all of the money that is raised, this is October, so We're here we have... Ahead, we know the St Hughes people. Here we have um, Nigel. And so um, these are available for £7 a piece. This is Tim Harrison. And you can pick up two for £10. These would make a fantastic uh, stocking filler gift for this Christmas. It is a bit of fun, but it's designed also to raise some money for uh, the place to be. Um, you know, Jay Price at Price and Son, uh, Martin at the Avenue Hotel have paid, I think, for the printing of these calendars. Um, there is opportunity perhaps to add some more in. I'd like to see these 500 go in an instant. Um, you know, please don't feel free just to buy two. If you've got a group and you want to buy ten, then have yourself ten for, for 50 quid. But I just want to say thank you very much for everybody coming along this evening. And if there's any questions, drop them in the messages here. The video will go out after this live as well. Uh, and we can pick up any orders or requests uh, via myself on Facebook perhaps. Also, Tracy, you could perhaps even message the place to be yeah. page as well. Or you can call me tomorrow on 0300 3020 147. Super stuff. Thank you very much for watching and see you all soon. Bye. 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 Thank you.